And good sex is a skill set. Yeah, I don't think we think about sex in that capacity for some reason. This is something that you have to do often, that you have to explore, that you have to evolve, that you have to grow and continuously learn the partner that you are with. And I'm just gonna keep it real with you guys. And even if you don't share this perspective, oh well. But we live in a society where we're so worried about body count. We're so worried about, you know, oh, I've been with this many people. Oh, I smashed this many girls. Oh, I was with this many. Oh, this, oh, oh, oh. Like we have all of these ideas of like wanting more and being with an abundance of people, thinking that that's the way and that's the reason why we have good sex. And I think there's something really powerful that needs to be said about slowing down and taking the time and the opportunity to explore one person's body at a time and fully, I'm saying fully, fully experiencing what that person's peaks and highs and valleys and moans and groans and different aspects of their body and understanding what that looks like in its fullness. And I'm talking about marriage, long-term relationships, all of that. I think it's important for us to, to do that, right? Because we will never really know what that peak and that pinnacle looks like if we're just going from one person to the next person, one person to the next person. That's not going to get us anything because that little two moves, the little bap bap, little wham wham that you got, <laughs> that might be cool, but it's not really cool because them two little pumps, is not gonna get anything done long-term. Especially when you're going from partner to partner. What if that girl, what if that man don't like the two pumps? Boo boo, what if they don't like that? And they want something else, they want something different, they want something unique, but you only got one trick, you up one, what they call it, a one trick pony, whatever they call it, and you doing the same moves on every single person. And they like, that ain't it, that's not, that's not working for me.